Hi guys! Candace missed that one. I did. Hey! Hi guys! <laughs> Hi! Um, we are back with our second snack crate box. This one is November's box. And for reference points, we already opened the October's, but this is like half the size, would you say? Yeah, it's a lot smaller. Of October's, so hopefully. Same price though, so. <laughs> we're a little, we don't know if October's was bigger. Like as a bonus, maybe, or if November's is just small. But we're gonna let it, Candace, open it. All hey, right. predictions first because we didn't put any in there. Um, I'm gonna say a South American Argentina. I'm going to say. I don't know. I froze. I froze. Um, I'm gonna say Germany. Oh, good one. All right, ready? All right. <gasps> okay, I, I am not kidding. <laughs> it is Germany. It's Germany. And so five seconds ago, I was at the fridge getting a drink, and she's like, I'm going to sneak real quick. So now I feel like she's No, I did, <laughs> I did not sneak. But that is fantastic that oh. I actually got. Also, the stickers are adorable. I feel like there needs to be a beer. I feel Sorry, like. I had a little snack. I like this. Mouth. This is adorable. Okay, I cannot believe that. I swear I did not. Look, it's on video because I had this rolling. I swear I did not. <laughs> cheat but Good that's cheat. fantastic all okay. right so capital is berlin population is 82 million 175 thousand wow fun facts it has the largest economy in europe there are over 150 castles in germany oh 65 percent of german autobahn highway systems have no speed limit i actually knew that uh um, because all of them I well, thought it was all. Like, well, actually, no, I might have too. Uh, German is the official language of five countries, which is Germany, Switzerland, Austria, Luxembourg, and Liechtenstein. So, fun fact: we used to pretend like we were from Luxembourg. <laughs> we didn't speak German, though. <laughs> we would have an English accent. Yeah, like a really, really like, like exaggerated one, like, like Chibi Hello. Like, I mean, like oh, I'm from Luxembourg, and it was terrible. Like, no one believed that. Actually, they did believe it. They did. Well, I mean, we were twins. They this is in college. <laughs> And we'd order egg burritos every morning from the same place in that accent. And they'd be like, oh, going to class, girls. We'd be like, yeah, you know. So we were trying, it was like a social experiment of ours to see if. I mean, I guess. <laughs> yeah, that happened. That's what we called it to make us yeah. feel less lame about and, it. Yeah, we but... were liars. And, uh, but we had a good time, yeah. We did. And so the it's entire marketing class. Yeah. Like, we didn't know anyone else. It was like a class of probably 500 people. We knew nobody. And we literally pretended like we were from Luxembourg. Luxembourg twins. <laughs> With British accents. <laughs> Oh, doggy. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> so, maybe we should add a German accent. <laughs> so, I would never be able to pull that off. All right. The first book print, but I always tell people I'm German. Because I'm like, oh, I'm big and hairy. That's, that's German. <laughs> like the trunch bowl, you know? Like, <gasps> Is you she know. German? I, mean, <laughs> I assume. I don't know. <laughs> She's talking about the person from Matilda, by the way. <laughs> All right. I think, for the record, I think we do have German in us, like a pretty high. We got everything in us. Our people like to. Uh, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. We're not selective. Okay. Anyway, all right. moving on. So the first book printed with movable type in Europe, the Gutenberg Bible, was printed in Mainz. Mainz. Wow. Know. I don't know. Uh, when JFK visited Berlin, he infamous, infamously told the crowd, "Each been in Berlin, Berliner," which roughly translates to "I'm a jelly donut." <laughs> I wonder what I was trying to say. Not that. <laughs> no, but this picture that they are showing here looks fake. Makes me want to definitely. Yeah. We're supposed so, to visit Germany in the next year and a half. In the next year and a half. Because we'll we have see. a friend living there and we want to go for free. Well, so, we I mean, want to stay for free. Stay for free, yeah. Um, we'll see. We've never been. All right, let's get this. Let's get um, it. My nose is driving me nuts. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. First thing I see oh, is. Let me see this. Oh, yeah. That's Palm's ketchup, so I'm thinking French fried chips with ketchup flavor. Oh, I mean, potatoes. Yeah. I mean, she also speaks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they're called XOX Palm's ketchup. What the hell is the crispy? Oh, I, I don't know. That's just what it says on here. Crispy potato fries. Oh, they're fries. You love me some mm -hmm. hot fries. Okay, fries flavored with tomato ketchup. I'm gonna I just think. show you that there's. Look at the size of this bag, <laughs> and look how they're. About oh, four of them in there. They had to come all the way from Germany. <laughs> yeah, they're not. <laughs> also, I thought they were gonna look like hot fries or like potato sticks, and they definitely are like they're hollow, giant, like inflated veggie straws. Yeah, that's why they give you four. 
Tastes like ketchup. Mm. Mm. I think it tastes like tomato soup. Yeah, but it's not as sweet as ketchup. But I think in other countries, their ketchup's not nearly as sweet as ours is. Like when I was in Australia, their ketchup is very... Um, that tastes like I'm eating, eating t Campbell's tomato soup. Yeah. All right. On a veggie straw. Okay. That's not bad. No. All right, next we have... Oh, no. Here we go. I'm, I'm excited to hear all of her. No, I'm not. Okay. Let's see here. Um, yeah, Ur the New Blackin Classic, a salty oh. puffed corn snack made with real peanuts. Wait, a how can it be a corn, corn snack. snack made with peanuts? This is my question. These are seriously addictive oh. and confusing. In the world. Okay. Oh, looks like Cheetos. Also, how can this be? I see the corn. How can it be made with peanuts? Weird, it tastes like peanuts. It tastes like you just. Licked the dust off of a Logan's Roadhouse floor. <laughs> Am I right though? I mean, I don't know. I've never done that, but I mean, I guess, yeah. Like when you walk into a Logan's and then you're the air is a so yeah. Thick. You know what I think it is is that there are these corn puffs that they rolled in peanut dust. I think she's right. Like, like I really think that's how it's made with real peanuts. Um, they're confusing. I don't think that they're bad. Not bad. But I, they're confusing because it's not. Ain't bad, they ain't good. All right. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, these look oh, fine. we love Haribo. Haribo, bala bala. Oh, it's Haribo. Oh, you might have two bags. You might not. Oh my god, I love those. Oh, I have two. Okay, we need to stop looking. But no, there's one. Okay, so you got the bala bala, which is colorful fruit flavored gummy candies cut into bite sized pieces. I feel like every snack crate, you're at risk of losing a tooth. Uh, uh, by the time I'm 40, I'll have dentures. <laughs> well, these, these look, look really... Fun. I wonder if they're different flavors. Oh, they're softer than I thought. They have like a... We're both in pink. Mm. They have like a creamy inside. Which isn't... I don't know what flavor I'm eating. Is it strawberry? I don't know. It it tastes very artificial. Do you know what I'm saying? Like I'm gonna try another color just to see if it's a different color. You can I had a pink one. one. I had a pink one too. Okay, let me try a new purple or green. Okay. Oh look, this one has like a yellow center. Mm -mm. No, that one was lemon, and even the inside cream was lemon, and it was good. I think the other one was strawberries and cream. Mm -hmm. This is like a lemon. I don't know what this is, but. <laughs> mm -mm. Alright, that's enough of those. Okay. So this is not great. <laughs> I feel like I really like Harbo products too, but. Mm. Alright, now we have. Hanuta this looks delicious. Hanuta Hasselnuss Schneid. <laughs> I think you need to grunt more. I think that in the German. Yeah, Schneid. right. Yeah, right. Okay. Um, Rich chocolate hazelnut filling sandwiched between two light and crispy wafers. Well, you know Shut the like, front door! You know we like, like hazelnut wafers. and we like, oh, and there's the two of them. Comes in such fancy packaging. Look at the wafer to chocolate ratio on that bad boy. Guys, All right. right here. This is where Germany makes up to us for that. Oh. Mm. Absolutely. Mmm. <laughs> It's like a Nutella sandwich. Yes. Mm. It is exactly what it's described. So good. There's like pieces of hazelnut, mm -hmm. creamy chocolate, crunchy wafer. This is delicious. Yeah, I'm gonna eat the rest of this. Um, that is delicious. Mm -mm -mm. I will be buying some of those. What is that? A tuna. Yeah. We'll never, we'll never remember the name. Oh my god. We'll that was some. delicious. This, well, this looks is weird. Fun. All right. This is called a hammer candy. Wait, wait. So let's check the old. Cool! It's called cool, evidently. Yeah, you cool. forgot that whole word. No, it says hammer candy right here. Oh. But okay, cool. so it says cool Har Harlinkin pop, an extra large lollipop with a chewing gum core, sour grape filling, and coated with little candy bits. That's not like a lot. I cannot do this. That's a lot going on for one lollipop. We have scissors oh. right here. I don't know why we're trying so hard. <clears throat> um, like maybe choose one. You know, it's like 
Oh so my. Sour candy, a large This would be like or... what any kid would pick out from the candy store. That thing's big. Like, let me just put my thumb beside it as a reference on how large that thing is. <laughs> I feel like, how do you even get started? Like, how do you eat an elephant? You know, one <laughs> bite at a time. I mean, it's huge. Like, how, oh. Oh, just throwing candy at it. All right, I got this piece. Tastes oh. like a nerd's rope on the outside. Yeah. But you know, they're actually not, um, how are they going? Hard. Oh, but with a weird aftertaste. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how you go. I, I, we have no idea what this tastes like because we'll have to stay here forever too. I mean, I'm not mad at it. I feel it's a little excessive, the packaging to lollipop. Like, just a saran wrap over that would have been fine. <laughs> um, I do appreciate this guy. Oh. I taste the sour greatness, so lick, lick the butt of it. <laughs> so it's like a filling, though. It's gum. I'm not going to work that hard for it. No, it's not. Okay, so... <laughs> With a chewing gum core and a sour grape filling. Maybe it means the grape, the lollipop itself is great. We don't know. There, there's we're, a lot going on. We're not going to invest that much in that one. All right. There's a lot in this. I feel like if you hate your life or need a new car, give your kids one of these while you're driving. All right. Um, this is just called a yes. <laughs> it's called, it's a Nestle's Sometimes Simplicity. Yes. Okay, yes, cacao, soft chocolate cake. Oh, I thought this was not going to be cake. Filled with rich chocolate cream and covered in chocolate. Okay, that sounds good. I thought that the cacao or whatever was like the... Oh, look how beautiful oh, that, that is. that is really nice. It's just a pretty Isn't nice. that like the health food chocolate though? Okay, the way that looked when you bit into it was actually made me salivate a little. <laughs> it's not from lack of food either. We've had a lot tonight. <laughs> That tastes like a really, really good zebra, not zebra cake. What are the ones? A fudge round? But like a... I thought you could this at a restaurant on a plate with drizzle. <laughs> Ooh, like ice cream? Mmm. Well, it tastes like... It tastes like the thing at Carnival, but the lava cake at, Car at Carnival. I think, it, I think it tastes like the, um, the dessert at Olive Garden. Oh, the black tie mousse cake. I think that's what it tastes like. You are correct. Okay, that's... That's pretty good. Very, very rich. Very decadent. It's delicious. Okay. Yeah. All right. Next we have... There's a lot in this box. Knoppers. I think it's nopers, but... <laughs> Knoppers. All right. This has wafers. And hazelnuts. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> Knoppers, hazelnuts. Tasty. No, it's knoppers. I was kidding. Oh. The <laughs> monkey see, monkey do. Oh. Oh. oh, my gosh. How do we choose? Wait. Okay. Tasty nugget cream, roasted hazelnuts, and milk cream sandwiched between two crispy wafers. It looks like a s'more, and I'm all about a s'more in my life. It so. looks delicious. I like where the Germans are at with the stuff like this. Oh. So that is even better than this guy. Because the, the milk, milk cream. cream takes it to another level. Yeah. It's basically this guy with an extra layer of milk cream. Oh yeah. That's phenomenal. Nopers? <laughs> All right. That's phenomenal. Oh, All right. I thought there was two of those, but I guess not. Two of what? The nopers. No. All right. Well, here's something, too. Oh, gosh. There's a lot in here. Okay. This is called the Corny Big. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yep. Or it's actually called the Corny Big Schnoko Banane. Is it banana flavored? Rice Krispie Treats. A rich candy bar made of whole grain and banana pieces dipped in milk chocolate. Why, you know? Why do you use whole grain in a candy bar? <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? Why waste it? Why Come waste on. it? Um, oh, though. I feel like nothing... This we might really be like have, a Rice Krispie Treat, though. Yeah. <laughs> we don't really have anything here that is flavored like banana. Oh, it oh, smells she super like banana-y. Oh, it does. It smells like... It smells like a monkey's dream. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I like the way up. It tastes like honey bunches of oats. With clove oh, bananas banana. on it. It's actually a lot better than it smells. I like it. Right. Or like those chocolate covered bananas you get at places. Yeah. Okay. Alright. We don't have any banana stuff here except for Laffy Taffy. And those are way too banana-y. Or right. like Bahama Bucks. You can get a bit, you know, yeah. like... This... Feels like the softest dream ever. This is called more more, <laughs> more more snack, 
for the Coochie Schneiden. <laughs> so, so I'm gonna try this. Guys, we apologize in advance because we're clearly not German, although we claim it. Yeah. We don't know why we've discovered, but- We just decided that was a good thing to tell us. <laughs> You're really like trunch and bowl. Yeah, the trunch bowl. Oh, okay. trunch and bowl. Anywho, anywho. Kuchenmeister Marmor snack. Delicious <laughs> slices of marble sponge cake flavored with vanilla and chocolate. Oh, it looks good. <clears throat> it's so That banana thing has a aftertaste. It's so soft. Oh, it's very moist. Unlike the Philippine <laughs> snack. Okay, I can't even get that part here. Oh, 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 oh okay, oh. okay. Tastes like a marble pound cake. Mm, tastes like pound cake. It's good. But that good stuff you get from Kroger. And it has like that kind of crisp, like that tiny crisp outside, you know, mm. where it's like almost like a sugar crust or something. It's good. I think we're going to have to save all of this because it's all really good. Okay. Evidently, we like European <clears throat> snacks with their sugar, hazelnut, and oh, wafers. wafers. Absolute. All right. That was good. I thought it was going to be kind of dry, but it was not. Okay, we've got Ritter Sport. Okay. We've got Nucking Sperker Gex and Edel Wolchmich Milch. <laughs> okay, so Ritter Sport Mini Bunter Mix. Tasty mini chocolate bars in a variety of flavors. Something for everyone. So they, I think they come in numerous different flavors right here. We got two different ones. Um, we have no idea. Remember, we, we don't know what at all what milch means. Yeah. And there's no indicators on the... No. Oh, okay. look at this though. They break into little pieces real That's nicely. Cute. Very cute. Oh, I think this is just milk chocolate. I mean... So apparently, and a vulture milch means milk chocolate. <laughs> very good though. That's some very delicious very milky. chocolate. Yeah. That is good. All right, it's from Ecuador. This one I feel like is a butter cracker dipped in chocolate. That okay. was a very delicious milk I chocolate. I could definitely be wrong though. Ooh. My belly's starting to hurt. <laughs> we are committed to you <laughs> and oh, to the snack craze. Oh, is it I hazelnut? It, no, I think it's a, a butter cracker. Is it cracker. toffee? No, I think it's a butter oh. cracker, listen. <laughs> She's right. Butter cracker. <laughs> Okay, she had a really good indication though. <laughs> Which was, I mean, you didn't let me see the wrapper. No, I'm just throwing it out there. All right. I appreciate that all this is written in German. Yeah, keeps us guessing. All right, now we have- That was also very good. Five little soft chews, it looks like. Mm. And I don't know what they're called. Oh, they are also soft. from the brand Cool, like our Lolly Big Pop. Lolly. And they're called <coughs> Cool Soft Cow Bonbon. Soft and chewy candy flavored with a variety of fruit flavors. So we've got orange, apple, strawberry, and lemon. Which one are you gonna go for? Lemon. I'm gonna go orange. Okay, Candace, they are pretty soft, but please watch the tukers. This is good. It tastes exactly like a high chew. Exactly what you would think it would taste like. Yeah. That was so great. All right, we got one thing left. Those, those are good. Mm -hmm. This is our favorite thing. We both had them and we love them. Hey, if you haven't seen it, I have a Target haul up from earlier this week and I haven't told you about this, but now they have Kinder Eggs here. But they're called, um, I don't know, but they come in a plastic thing. And it says toy and snack or something on the outside. So I got one for each of my kids for, they're stocking, so hopefully. Anyway, we love Kinder, was the whole reason I was saying. And we are always no looking. bars in particular. Didn't love. you have these sent to you? Mm -hmm. She ordered some off I the ordered internet. ordered a case of 24. And had them, like, she rationed them for, like, yeah, a while. For, forever. Yeah. I would have, like, one a week. I so love, she loves the Bueno bars. So they're them. Kinder Bueno, layers of delicious crispy wafer filled <laughs> with a rich hazelnut cream and coated in milk chocolate. Oh, our favorite. <laughs> <laughs> If you want to impress us, slap some hazelnut <laughs> chocolate on a wafer. a wafer of any kind. And we will be your friends yeah. forever. Oh. So, yeah, I used to ration these. I did. I had a, a case sent to my house. Not in North Carolina. Didn't you pay kind of like oh, yeah. more than you should have? I'm that? sure. 
They're so good though. I'm having a real hard time. I think now though, I think you can buy them at the international food section. Oh. This, right. That was a while ago. Snap it off. Yeah, this was like back when I was in grad school. So the best part about it is it's like creamy, like actual liquid cream on the inside. It's delicious, but I'm very bueno. You're an idiot. <laughs> it's very good. No, right. they're delicious. Like, <clears throat> this was a good box. This was a great box. I don't think I didn't like anything. All right, my favorite, I mean. Even the things that I was like, eh. Oh, that's not true. I didn't like the Logan's Roadhouse floor candy. <laughs> <laughs> like that's what we're calling. Shout this out to was, Logan's. <laughs> <laughs> this video is not sponsored by them, but they this was them. weird, no, but in a good way. Like, I mean, like it was edible, but weird. Yeah. So the bueno bars, and then any the way for hazelnut. This is always anything. Annoying. Anything like that. Also the yes bar that tasted like the, well, that was like a, that was like a this dessert. Like I mean, like super a cake. good. Yeah. I liked all the sweet stuff better than the salty stuff on this box, whereas in the other box, I liked all the salty stuff better. So interesting. Okay, so um, your next box is coming. Yeah, I'm gonna be gone for a couple weeks. Ditto. So when we get back, there will be one. So we'll oh, have look, to... it says thank you. Does the other one? I don't know. Hashtag don't go. It does. It's all along. We've just been missing out. Okay, so predictions. Oh, we got Asia and Europe this time. We've had Canada and Mexico. Mm -hmm. We've had France. We have not had the United States. I'm going to go with... Have we had Australia? No, we haven't had Australia. I'm going to go Australia. I, I guess that a lot, but I feel like it's got to happen eventually. So, I don't know if we ever mentioned this, but when we were planning that trip, we decided to go to Bali. So, I'm going to go Indonesia. That ain't going to be it. <laughs> All right. But I'm going to go Indonesia. Have we had Japan? We've had Japan. Mm -hmm. We have not had China. Have we, we had China? Korea? No, we haven't had China. Korea. Did we have Japan? Yeah, we had Japan. We remember it had, we had those, that The spin. Pocky yeah, Six. The and, yeah. All right. Okay. Thanks so those everybody. are our predictions. Yes. Like this video. Subscribe below. We'll see you soon. I'm doing Vlogmas right now, so you can watch some of those. And we will see you soon. Right, bye. bye.